which should be now. Making the veganist bag. I think that's a cattle crush. Right there. So I think uh, their head goes in there, like they come in through this side, their head goes in there, holds them down. They inseminate them in that cattle crush. Yeah, that's another cattle crush there. For uh, insemination. Hello darling, hello, hello sweetheart, you're just budding, it's like they got the organs painted on the side of the cow there, so they can like, I don't know, map out their anatomy, some type of Very weird. Just for a little calf. It's like a calf feeding. <laughs> Thank you. What does it say? Uh, it's just the, um, so when they take the calves away, they give them a formula. We could probably go inside there and see if they're doing any shows. We could probably set the table up just there. Do you reckon? We're gonna get kicked out, but let's try Straight it. Straight away. Yeah, but let's try it. We should. The suckers. Suck the milk out. Plug them on the nipples. Suck the milk up. <laughs> no thanks, I'm a vegan. <laughs> Shit, there must be animals around here. Yeah, I can smell animal manure. It's just right there. Looks like they're doing like a show here, showing off the different dairy cows. Similar to like a dog show, but like a cow, cattle show. I don't know whether it's like a competition or they get awarded. Really peculiar and really bizarre. Like, yeah, it's like they're putting them on show, like, Kind of similar to like um, a live auction, but they're just, you know, in the middle of this place getting analyzed by everyone. It's, it's like, when you objectively look at this, it's really, really bizarre. Sweetheart, how are you? Oh, ear tagged. Pure slavery. Nothing, no other word to describe this but slavery.
stuck thinking about where to set this table up, eh? All right, so we just come back out from the dairy show in there. It was so bizarre, like, I was sort of lost for, lost for words. Like, they're there parading around these Holstein uh, cows, like, showing them off, brushing them. And at the same time, there's people walking around eating burgers with the bodies of other cows and eating cheese made from their exploited bodies and just a really bizarre culture. Like, you know, the animals are right there. There's all of these, um, they're selling all of this equipment that they use to forcibly impregnate them. You know, rape racks for sale in there and, you know, just complete exploitation just being, just being normalized and to the point where it's so consciously in their face, they're just a, another level of conditioned in there that just didn't seem bothered or it's just normal, business as usual. Parading around these animals, pure explo exploitation, nothing, um, they don't, like when farmers say, I care about my animals, I care about my animals, only to the point that they make the profit for them, I believe, and it seems like they care about them like you would care about your car. You keep your car clean and, you know, you make sure your car's working good and so then you can go on and sell your car later on. That's just like, it was pure objectification of these animals. They were just looked at as objects to parade around, to exploit, to make money from and to later kill and eat, you know, real intimate objectification of these animals like intimate as in closely connected to the point where they end up eating their bodies later like real i don't know just real disconnect that's all i got to say about that eh? Yeah. just feel really weird nice no, it's, it's it's real pure objectification exploitation <laughs> yeah this is going to kick up a little bit of a storm i reckon Right. Gotta be done. Okay, let's just walk quick so it just looks like we're doing something. What about right here? You reckon this is hilarious? Yep. Uh, I think we need uh, some tape. If anyone wants to have a conversation here. Have you given permission to start this stuff up here? Oh, obviously I have. Obviously you have. <laughs> Are we allowed to have conversations with people as they come out? Okay. Well, we want to have a civilised conversation about this topic with people that come out. Hey? Controversial, but... You think it's controversial? Don't all dairy cows get slaughtered though, hey? They do though. Are you a dairy farmer? Yeah. Do you send all the cows to be slaughtered afterwards? I don't want to argue with you, bro. Just an objectively true statement. It's more a reality, not really what I believe. No, 50% of the beef in this country comes from slaughtered dairy cows. So most, all dairy cows are slaughtered, yeah? It depends if you consider slaughter murder. <laughs> Yeah, but the act of taking someone's life. The debate table's open. No, because you haven't paid for your table, so you, you can't... Oh, do I have to pay for a table here? But, yeah. It, oh, I didn't know. Because it's, it's a private event, so you can't... I can't, I can't do this discussion with people here? Not here, you can't. Okay. You, Where's the nearest public land? 
Public land will be outside the gate. So, but even outside in that car park yeah, area is public. This is all private property. Oh, so. yeah. All right, all right. Um, no worries. I understand. You could, you I thought I'd outside. give it a crack anyway, eh? Absolutely. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah. <laughs> obviously, everyone's got a right to protest. Without but that man's permission, yeah. Sorry. Are you recording without that man's permission? No. No. Show me. Your I'm, I'm, I'm recording the table, dude. You're recording your conversation. That's illegal. No, it's not. You're in the UK, are you? Are you from Ireland? <laughs> yeah. You're in the UK. Yeah. We're in Europe. Yeah. Another <laughs> way. <laughs> UK's got specific laws about filming. I know. I know them. Do you? What are they? <laughs> what do you think about this statement? It's a point of view. It's your point of view, I think. Are you a dairy farmer? Yeah. Okay. So all yeah, oh, dairy cows get slaughtered, yeah? That's, that's the only thing I'm saying. So we all dairy. Yeah, 50% of the beef comes from dairy cows, yeah? It just depends on whether you think slaughter's murder. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. Just an objective statement. You're entitled to your opinion. Yeah. You shouldn't force it on other people. It's not really an opinion though, it's, a, it's objective reality. It's your opinion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll pick it up for you, mate. I don't want to make your job too difficult. It's okay, thank you very much. <laughs> You're a very friendly security guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nah, I didn't think that. Alright, we'll try somewhere else then. <laughs> like I say, out, outside the gates. Go for it, yeah, public land. It is public land. It, yeah. it is private property. Totally right? understand. So, I guess, um, I guess that dairy farmer thought I was forcing my opinions, but the only ones who are being forced are the animals who are being forced down the kill floor to their death for beef and for dairy and for all other animal products. So, I guess the only person forcing their opinions people who consume animal products and send animals to a vicious, um, brutal demise. Bolt gun in the skull, knife across the throat. Infant animals being taken from mothers year after year. Yeah, selling rape racks to rape animals before they steal their children. Like, interesting, hey? Seemed really nice, didn't you? <laughs> Sorry guys, uh, you haven't paid for a table. <laughs> I should have said, well, I'll pay for one. <laughs> <laughs> we'd, li we'd like you to stay, but uh, you know, <laughs> you haven't paid for that table. <laughs> I said, I'd, well, we did pay for it. Got it off Amazon. <laughs> Worth the 60 pounds, that sign. Uh, looks like we didn't last five minutes before, <laughs> before being kicked out, so. Looks like uh, people don't really want to hear the truth. I'll call it a new record. 